Salve discipuli, Magister Wesley sum, hodie linguam latinam legemus. Today we're going to be going over some Latin phrases and vocabulary. Remember, please, if you like this content, like and subscribe below and be sure to hit that notification bell because more is coming. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm going to go change into something a little bit more contemporary. Hi, welcome back to the Homeschool History Show, Latin series, week seven. So today we're going to continue with a vocabulary list of nouns. Many of these are coming from common Bible verses, and you may kind of be able to piece together where this is coming from just based on the grouping of the words, but they're also just common words for the most part. So yeah, take from it what you will. Vita means life, vital signs, vitality, all that good stuff. V-I-T-A, life. Lux. L-U-X means light. The traje de luces. In Spanish, I'm sure I mispronounced that. You can let me know in the comments below. But lux, luce, luces, the suit of lights that a bullfighter wears, right? It's all bright. Lux means light. Homo, hominum means man. Homo sapiens, the, the man who knows things. The, the animal that knows things is what we are described as. It's the species description of a human being in science and biology. It comes from Latin. And then finally, nomen. Nomen mihi, Mr. Wesley est. Nice to meet you. Nomen means name. Nomenclature. Right? Things of that nature all come from that word, nomen. Nomen in Latin. Nombre in Spanish. Uh, I believe it's nom in French. Nom de guerre, name of war. All come from this word, nomen. So that's it for this week's nouns. Steady progress, steady building of a vocabulary list, and finally, you'll be ready to converse with history directly. Now, remember, Dona Geturum, Historia Sufa.